Hey guys, here is a video on a goblin style canopy that I got for my little nano CPX. Um, I picked this up from a guy named Composite over on Helifreak. So if you guys are interested in the canopy, uh, be sure to do with the search or just if you guys are on Helifreak, just look up the guy named Composite. He came up with this goblin style canopy for the nano and I believe it will also fit the MCPX. Um, you can see here, it fits pretty nicely on my nano. It's not too, just the weight itself is not too heavy at all. It's a little bit heavier than the stock canopy, but you know, it's not that bad at all for a, it's a very thin canopy, so it's not that heavy, guys. <laughs> um, you can see here, uh, it's a clear canopy, but underneath the uh, inside, there's a protective layer, so it does look a little bit hazy and kind of bubbly inside, but once you remove that plastic protective layer, uh, it will shine. And what I plan on doing with this one is to paint it the goblin, the green goblin or the orange goblin style canopy depending on what fast color paints I have available. But I plan on doing a goblin style canopy and painting from the inside. So hopefully my attempt to paint from the inside comes out nice because you can see here underneath the inside everything is open so it shouldn't be that hard to you know put that liquid mask in there and cut it out and trim it out and you know airbrush it in so it shouldn't be that hard but if anything else fails I'll just end up painting from the outside and it does add a little bit more weight because when you paint on the outside of the canopy sometimes you have to put a coat of clear to get that shine for the colors to come through but we'll see how the final product looks it might take me a few days to actually come up you know with the color scheme mask it out and uh, getting that final product but you can see it looks very nice here's the front view let me focus for you guys it doesn't really look like anything because there is no coloring on here but a good thing about this canopy is the top does come pre-cut out for you, but the canopy posts are not cut out, so it's not drilled for you. So what this means is you can pretty much, uh, when you get it, you can position the canopy anywhere on your helicopter, and it is clear. So before you actually paint it, just before you paint it, mark it out with a Sharpie or just draw the hole with a uh, X-Acto knife like what I have over here. But just mount it, you know, see where you want to position your canopy, make sure everything is nice and correct before you, you know, before you drill it and just mark it with the sharpie and drill it out and see how it is and afterwards you're good to paint because once you paint it it's going to be a little bit difficult to see where the canopy post is but you know this canopy looks very nice it does have that full scale look to it so I'm pretty excited you know I always love that look of the goblin style and just having something this small just to look at like a goblin would be very very neat but just want to give you guys a quick video on a little canopy I picked up. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. So there you go, guys. <laughs>